Hi everybody, this is uh, Brother Brayside Allotment. Sorry I haven't been on for a while, we've been away on holiday, so I've just pulled, the, pulled these carrots. <laughs> I've never had carrots like these before. This is the best carrot harvest I've ever had. And uh, I mean, I've had about 20 out already. This is just the rest of them. So I uh, can't grumble. Now then, I've got a bit of a disaster as well now. The leaks. A lot of them have bolted. I took some home and we cut them and they were just rock hard inside. So they've all bolted, I don't know why. So, <laughs> that's the name of the game, I suppose. You lose some, you win some. Now then, here, I put a uh, well rotten manure on here. The uh, Japanese onions are going in here next week. They're going in that bed, uh, this bed, because the cabbage have nearly finished. Probably get a bit more off of them and that's it. So they've nearly had it. Put another bag of manure in there. Uh, lettuce, <laughs> lettuce are bolted, but there you go. But we've had loads off it anyway. And there's going to be a bag of uh, manure going in there. So it's going to be Japanese onions, Japanese onions, garlic, and red onions. That's the plan. I will definitely do carrots again, but uh, uh, I'm a bit disappointed with the, uh, the leaks. Not done too well. Oh, <laughs> I'll just show you my courgettes, my God. We've had loads of courgettes, obviously. We've had loads off. And we've been eating them and in pan with black pepper and oil. And, and I missed, <laughs> I miss two courgettes. And <laughs> there they are. Thank you, Moncus. So that's that. I've got uh, the um, oh, what do you call them there? Uh, oh, King Edward potatoes in this bed. I haven't dug them up yet. So actually, when I pull the um, courgettes out, two it's supposed to come to the top, and they were huge. Cavernero, I keep taking leaves off and we keep having them. The Cavernero, keep taking leaves off and, and they look healthy, they still look pretty healthy. I might let one go to seed and then I can take the seeds off them. Leeks, I'm very disappointed with. It's the first bad year I've ever had. Still no uh, peaches on the peach tree, but there you go. That's going to go this year. It's gone. I've had enough. So it was just a quick uh, visit. I'm, I'm going to show you when I do it. Uh, I'll pull the King Edwards out. Oh, I've still got some second earlies in these tubs as well. They keep better in the muck, actually. They keep quite a while in the muck, so that's good. Uh, Polytonal tomatoes have done. I've had absolute... Oh, I'll show you. I've absolute... Oh. I must have had 15 bags of tomatoes. Barry's had two lots. Daughter's had two lots. Sons had two lots, next door neighbours had two lots, God knows how many we've had. I think we've had about ten bowls full, I don't know. I've never had tomatoes like this, ever. So I've been stripping leaves back now, they've nearly finished. So, as you can see, I've stripped them nearly all down. All nearly been stripped down. And uh, I've just picked... Just, just picked a bag full here and I put some in a drawer, let them go in red. So, but uh, yeah, there's a good load in there, there's a good, a good few in there. These are the money penny, can't beat money penny. And the chilies, I've had loads of them. There's a few more to come yet. Now then, I don't know where to cut them back and let them come back or not. Is it worth the bother? I don't know. But uh, I shall take all this muck out of here and refresh it for next year. So, I've got still got chippings to get. I've got strimming to do. I've got the hut to paint. Look, I can't do that all, but winter can't I? These are the cause yet plants I've took out. I'll just let them rot down a bit, then they can go in the compost. 
But uh, no, I'm not so, oh, I'm not so good with rhubarb either. That's been a bit of a disaster, I don't know why. But still, never mind. I can't get over the carrots, that's the best carrots I've ever done. In fact, it's the only carrots I've ever done. <laughs> I mean, look at them. Fantastic. Right, I'm going to leave, leave you and love you. Thanks for watching. If you like what you see, just press that subscribe button and ring that little old bell. Bye now.